Elena says, uh, I saw that the prices on Chanel handbags on the second-hand market is going down. Of course, my dear, you, even the prices of apartments are going down right now. <laughs> what do you expect? Everything is going down. The only thing that's not going down is toilet paper prices. <laughs> um, certain raw materials that companies need to keep producing, uh, those prices are going up. But everything else is going down. I'm quite shocked that these luxury brands haven't gone into sale yet. Like their, their prices online are still full prices, even though they're not selling anything. I uh, wish I could afford some, uh, uh, some 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 Chanel. I'm new to Chanel as a fan, though. Listen, there's amazing stuff uh, secondhand. Now I know it's a bit tricky when I say secondhand, and everybody then I get all these DMs asking me to authenticate. Uh, guys, I don't authenticate for other people. I don't do that. That that's something that I don't do that. And then uh, questions where to buy secondhand. I don't I don't tell you where to buy secondhand because I don't want to tell you where to buy secondhand, and then you buy it, and then it turns out that the seller was you know selling a fake product i don't take that responsibility it's too tricky you got to do your research and you got to do a lot of research i've been burned before myself it's difficult to but it takes time you need a lot of patience when you're buying second hand it takes a lot of time to learn how to recognize what is authentic and what isn't so even if you don't have a budget to go into a boutique right to buy new from a boutique you can still if you do your research and you learn and you know how to how to evaluate what is authentic and what isn't you can make incredible deals and you could afford stuff for way less. we're not talking about the classic bags i mean bags are always going to be expensive they're the most like in your face it's like okay this is chanel it's a bag i'm wearing chanel look at it you know that's kind of that's why they go for a lot of money but there's so many beautiful chanel pieces that have the quintessential chanel dna but are not uh in that category of reselling for really, really high prices because the masses don't care for them as much. Those are the pieces I'm very interested in. Because I love the Chanel DNA, the Coco DNA, without it being a sellout. 